of cabinet minister. The opposition is accusing industry minister Tony Clement of a conflict of interest after he did a commercial for a chemical company in his Ontario riding. Clement was health minister at the time. The video only aired in China, but in this CTV News exclusive, our Ottawa bureau chief, Robert Fife has obtained a copy. This ad isn't selling the Canadian outdoors, it's selling a Canadian chemical company to China. And who better to act as pitchman than a high-profile cabinet minister? I'm Minister of Health for Canada. First of all, I want to extend my greetings to the people of China. Tony Clement did this promotional video in August 2008 for a company based in his writing. Let me have the honor to introduce to you Mr. Barry Young, who is the President and CEO. The science of Lord and Partners is very interesting. It's highly unusual for ministers to play no, such a role. He just introduced, that's what he did. And do you think it made a difference? I think so, yes. The infomercial was produced by one of Clement's political supporters. I had raised the profile and gave very credibility in China. And, you know, what better way can you do it than a federal minister? Clement later named his friend to the Canadian Tourism Commission when he became industry minister. That is way, way over the line. The opposition says it's unethical for Clement to open doors for friends. A minister of the Canadian government promoting one specific company over all others uh, would be clearly uh, giving that company preference. Clement was in Amsterdam and wouldn't agree to an interview. He released this statement. Just because this company is from Perry Sound, Muskoka, does not mean it cannot seek help from its MP to enter new markets. This is clearly not a conflict. I can't imagine a more blatant conflict of interest than a cabinet minister using his office to shill for a private employer. The same company also received three untendered federal contracts this year, valued at $41,000. Is he doing promotional videos for every company in his writing? Is he doing promotional videos now as Minister of Industry for any company that approaches him? Tony Clement's office says the minister has done only one other promotional video for the Toronto Hospital for Sick Children. Lloyd. And he's probably safe enough with the sick kids video. Well, Bob, first of all, how is this a conflict of interest for the minister? Because he was, after all, promoting a company in his own writing. Lloyd, ministers are supposed to represent the whole country. There are other companies trying to sell the very same product to China, yet the minister is acting as a huckster for the one company that happens to be in his writing. Also, the conflict of interest code says it's wrong for ministers to promote the private interest of their friends. Well, Tony Clement, after all, is seen as a top-line minister in the Harper cabinet. So might he be in trouble here with the prime minister? Not at all, Lloyd. The prime minister's office says he does not have a financial interest in this company. Therefore, they do not believe he is in a conflict of interest. The prime minister is going to stand be behind him all the way. They do not want to lose a minister of Mr. Clement's caliber. All right. Thanks, Bob. Good night, Lloyd.